All right, testing. All right, second edition line man's and cable man's field manual. Okay, so Thomas M. Shoemaker, James E. Mack. Chapter one: Electrical system, electrical drawing system, material drift, representation, electrical system unit measure. Measurement, uh, metric equivalent, temperature, temperature, definition, formula, calculation, direct current, circuits, reverse series, resistive circuits, parallel, resistive circuits, alternating current, circuits, power factor, electrical apparatus, motors, alternating current, generator, transformer, single phase, summary, electrical formulas, current, voltage, resistance, power loss, impedance, power, voltage, volt, um, power, volt, ampers, power factor, motor, line conductors. Um, we'll just come back to the chapter, um, the uh, table of contents each chapter. Uh, I'm going to skip the preface and the acknowledgments. All right, chapter one: the electrical systems. Um, electrical drawing systems. Diagram: electrical circuit show the manner electrical devices are connected to because it would be possible to draw those draw each of the devices shown in the diagram. The devices represented with a symbol list of some of the most common electrical systems used as follows. Noted that the symbols are some sort of simplified picture of the device that represent with the readers and current. To um, review IEEE standard 315 NASI Y322CSA3 Z99 graphic symbol electrical electron diagram. Alright, show the uh, air circuit breaker um, air circuit breaker with uh, convex um, breaking between the lines. Air circuit breakers double um, draw out loop. Um, the double arrowhead um, convex break. Three poles, uh, three different lines, uh, dotted line in between. Between the convex and double arrow breaks on each line, air circuit breaker um, shows the uh, convex line with a, um, one a zigzag and the magnetic overload cable termination shows the empty triangle in, embedded in the line capacitator. A convex uh, concave line with a solid line coil, a square electromagnetic actuator, a square with both lines coming out. Uh, asterisk represents uh, designations um, device resonations. All right, we're going to skip these um, symbols, but you can print them out. I think it's more important to like, read on. Um, pictorial representation. For particular overview of the different parts, different parts of the electrical system, see figure 1 through 1, 1, 1 through 4, show the generator starting at 38,000 volt generator housing service power of the transmission substation voltage increase to 3,000. 3,450 volts, 3,450 volt transmission substation from the transmission line industrial conductor. Customer um, transmission substation first voltage dip reduction 69,000 volts to the uh, um, substation substrain um, sub transmission power center industrial 69,000 volts uh, transmission second voltage reduction distribution substation 38,000 uh, 13,800 volts commercial um, industrial customer 13,800 volts distribution commercial customer distribution transformer. Um, 120 volts to 240 volts was the residential customer. Um, subway volt. Uh, the system module enterprise generation transmission distribution electricity. All right, one two single schematic entire um, process. Show the uh, nuclear generation system transmission system um, substation to uh, which um, uh, and the f fossil fuel generation system transmission fuse lines. Transmit um, hydraulic generation transmission substation transmission circuits to the adjacent uh, utility companies A um, transmission substation B and sub transmission system subsystem um, substation C uh, distribution substations 10 11 and 12 uh, overhead distribution circuits um, fused out cut out underground distribution um, circuits um, pole type transformers overhead service overhead secondary uh, overhead services uh, number of pole type switch and underground services, underground secondary pipe padded mounted transformer. So technically, you can't change your uh, um, your uh, electric company by the substations. Um, let's go to one three. All right, one is the five section, um, five seasons. Two is Harrison Homes. Three is Georgetown Square. Four is uh, five Sherwood Road. Um, four is Ted uh, Mobile. Uh, Ted's mob Mobile Home. Six seven. Meadow Book, 8, Royal Wood, 9, Hearth and Heights, 10, Hearth and Heights. And then, uh, alright, figure 1, force is a single line schematic distribution system group, uh, operator switch number, uh, power pole transformer, commercial customer, 280, um, Y, 123-phase volt, overhead distribution, main field, operated number switch, NNC, um, fuse 
Cut out primaries, fuse, um, sole service bowl type transformers, secondary service service residential customer 120, volt, 40 volt, single pole switch, pot heads, substation, exit cable, spot heads, distribution, substation, circuit breakers, spot heads, um, pad mounted switch, break, um, switch gear, underground distribution, feeder circuit, underground residential circuit, pad mounted switch gear, uh, underground commercial, three phrase circuits, pad mounted transformer, service hospital, 480 wide, 277, three volts. All right, unit measurement. One minute is equal to 60 seconds. One hour is equal to 60 minutes. 3,600 um, seconds. One day is 24,000. Uh, 24 hours is 1,440 minutes. 86,440 seconds. 60 hertz. AC electrical system. 60 cycles per second. One second is equal to 60 seconds. 60 cycles. 100 milliseconds is equal to 6 cycles. 150 milliseconds is equal to 15 cycles. 500 milliseconds 30 cycles. Length, one foot is 12 inches, one yard is 3 feet, through 36 inches, one mile is 1,760 yards, times um, 5,280 feet, is 63,360 inches. Decimal, mil is, um, mil is um, 10 to the negative third, centimeters 10 to the negative two, decimal is 10 to the negative one, kilo is 10 to the negative, 10 to the third, mega is 10 to the six. All right, you metric conversions, one inch, uh, 0254, two inch, 508. Uh, uh, three and zero seven six two um four and zero ten seven sixteen um so uh and uh add two hundred fifty four um thousands um ten thousands uh, of an inch uh, for every inch of metric to in meters to meters um one foot meters um one foot is equal to thirty point forty eight centimeters one year is equal to nine um 90, 91, 941 uh, 940 91 um zero, nine, uh, nine thousand one hundred forty four ten thousandths of a meter ninety one point four four centimeters or ninety nine hundred fourteen point four millimeters one mile is equal to one thousand six hundred nine point thirty five meters or one uh, and one kilometer is equal to one thousand one point six oh nine three five kilometers metric use us millimeter was zero um is one and one three thousand nine hundred thirty seven to ten thousand um one hundred thousand of an inch centimeter and then that moves its decimal place to the left um meter and then a uh, kilometer i try to uh, kind of separate those central um your centigrade of fahrenheit celsius is equal to five nines um times the fahrenheit pre temp in degrees times minus 32 fahrenheit to centigrade is equal to Nine divided by five in the grays of Celsius to thirty-two. Two degrees Celsius is thirty-two degrees Fahrenheit. One hundred degrees Celsius two hundred twelve degrees Fahrenheit. Those are freezing and boiling. Um, definition: Voltage, electrical force work required to move the current through the electrical circuit to measure the unit volt. The volts are unit the measurement volts for the electrical circuit. The denote the symbol V. The current in the flow of the free electron. General direction measured using am amps. The symbol is I amps. Unit amp measure measurement electrical current denoted the symbol A. Um, direct current um, DC current flows continually in one direction. Alternating current a AC current flow for the circuit in position direction of the reverse in itself for the flow of the negative direction. Uh, um, resistant electrical friction that must be overcome through the device in or order to uh, resistance of the electric uh, or are the electrical friction that overcome the device in order for the current to flow with the voltage applied um, um and there's uh omega sign of the unit measurement of the resistant electrical circuit to know the um, symbol omega indicating inductance or h of the property of the current with the flow low voltage um of the lag of the voltage measured unit in henry's h is for henry's capacity f the um property of the cover of the current leave the voltage measured in infrared f um Energy, uh, watt per hour, uh, the amount of the electrical work with the real power with the consumer, the utilized an hour, the unit measurement, the watt hour, the power, um, P, the combination of electrical current voltage cutting, um, electrical, uh, electricity to produce work with the power is to consume the two components of the real power and reactive power, voltage ampers, um, the unit of both real, um, uh, and reactive power and electrical circuit, real power, the resistant, um, power portion of the load found and taking the cosine of the angle of the current voltage out of phase. Y or W, uh, yeah, the abbreviation W, the unit of the real power of the electrical circuit, um, reactive power of the reactive portion of the load found and taking the sin over the angle of the current voltage area out of phase. Variance or Q, the merit, um, the unit of the reactive power of the electrical circuit, the power factor, PF, um, the ratio of the real power to the reactive power, frequency, 
F um, is the lowercase F, the number of the complete um, cycle of the pain per second measured in units in hertz. Hertz is HS uh, or HZ, the unit frequency equal to one cycle per second. Conductors material have the many of the frequency electrons, so you can get good in transportation flow electrons. Well, currents insulated materials are hardly any of the free, free, free electrons inhibit the restriction flow of electrical current. Series resistive circuit all resistive devices are connected to each other with the same current flow for all the devices. Parallel resistive circuit with the resistive device connected with the current voltage to short the current of the path of the parallel path to divide the only a portion of the current flow over the each of the parallel paths. What formulas and calculation? In this section, the most common electrical formulas are given there. Use the illustration of the problem that each of the cave of the formulas save the youth of the cost of the customary symbol to examine the expression of state of the words and problems is given the only substitution are made with the symbol of the formula from the wall, which is the answer for the calculated only these formulas are aligned and apt to the form um have the youth that are given them but the formulas are divided into three groups DC circuit, AC circuits, and electrical apparatuses. Um so the formula on flow must be fundamental electrical formula expressed for the relationship with the depth of the electrical circuit that contains uh, continuing resistance only between the current flow of the end of the resistance. The voltage is impressed with the resistance of the resistance. Of the, of, of the circuit. So amps would be equal to the volts over the ohms expressed in the words of the form of state of the current equals the voltage divided by resistance. Amperage is equal to the volts over the ohms. How much the direct flow of the flow of the resistance of the 10 ohms is measured applied with the 120 volts of the direct current. Only um, so you'd have uh, 120 volts over the 10 uh, ohms would give you 12 amps. I'm Involved in the um, I'm not involved in three kinds of current voltage and resistance. Therefore, the any of the two are known, but the third one can be found in the procedure. Of the, um, um, solve the current with the radian and straight the the voltage required to circulate with a given amount of the current known as the uh, resistance. Um, ohm's law is written as the volts is equal to the amps times the ohms. Um, in the word formula, say that the voltage is equal to the current multiplied by the resistance volts is equal to the amps over the ohms. How much direct current of the DC volts required to divide the ohms? Um, direct current through the resistance of 15 ohms, you have uh, 75. Five volts in like manner, the voltage of current are known with the value of the resistance found with the formula of volt, um, ohms is equal to the volts over the amps. Um, you should, should get express the words or formula said they have the resistance equal to the derived the current with the ohms is equal to the volts over the amp. The resistance of the electrical circuit is 120 volt with the direct current called the, the five amps. You'd have 24 ohms. Series resistive circuit. 12 volt battery has three lamps connected with the series. The figure of I15 of the resistance each of the lamp with the eight ohm with the most over that much of the current. In the circuit, in the circuit, the resistor of the current all day with resistance are added together to define the following: resistor series is equal to the R1 plus R2 R um, plus the R um, each R um, resistor um, resistance in the field on the equal total. Therefore, you'd have 28 ohms um, for uh, uh, and because uh, amps equal the volts over ohms, you'd have uh, 12 over 24 would give you a half a amp parallel resistor circuits. The battery, um, the 12 volt battery of three lamps connected with the parallel of the resistance of the each lamp with the eight ohm with the most, uh, much of the current flowing in the circuit with the solution of the parallel is if the all resistance can be added together and in the form of one over the resistance parallel is equal to one over the resistance one, resistor two, resistor the, um, three, uh, or two, whatever number of the resistor serial circuit, the same current flow through the lamps. One sixth of the parallel circuit, each lamp is independent of the other lamp that's drawn in its own circuit. So, uh, and only three examples of one over the resistor parallel. Um, you'd have uh, eight times eight times eight times um, um, times eight times eight plus eight times eight plus eight times eight, which gives you two point six seven ohms. Um, um, twelve point over two point six seven and four point five amps. Powerful, power form. The expression of the power drawn by the DC circuit is um, the, the volts and the amps. The symbol of the volts over the current of the amp of the perspective of the power with the symbol of the watt. The Breath of the word formula shape of the power and watts drum of the DC is equal to the product of the volts and plus power is equal to the volts times the amps. How much power is taken with the 120 volt DC with the current flowing with the 8 amps? So you'd have 120 times 8, 960 watt. With the power formula contained with these three quantities watt, volts, and amps. Therefore, any of the two, three are known, but the third one can be found. The produce of the finding of the power of the voltage current through are given and already illustrated. The power and the voltage are given them with the current is found with the formula. Um, amps is equal to the power over the volts. In the words of formula, shape of the current equal to the divide of the volts of the amperage equal to the watts over the volt. The how much direct um, current with a thousand watt load with the draw um draw one connected to the 120 volts. One thousand over 120 will give you the 8.3 amps. In like manner, the power current is also known. The voltage can be found with the rating of the power and volts is equal to the power over the amps. Express the formula: the voltage is equal to the power divided by the current volts is equal to the watts over the amps. The DC volts required to deliver the 600 amps. The 6 amps, the direct current flow would give you 110 amps. Or sorry, 110 volts line. And loss resistance, the formula is computing the power law of the resistance current flow with equal to the power is equal to the amp squared times the resistance.
This gives you the line of resistance law. Where the symbol will have the same thing, uh, meaning of the following formula express the and more following step of the power light will watch left the resistance equal to the square of the, the current of the amperes multiplied with the resistance of the ohms. Thus, so you take square root of your m or your line and you uh, times it by the resistance and you get your watch. So the watch would equal the amp squared over the m. The compute with the watts and line having resistance four ohms when the amps are directing the current flowing. At the um, so they have eight times eight. Um, this is uh, the amp squared times four would give you two hundred fifty-six um, watts. Two so square means to multiply by itself electrical energy electrical energy electrical work the formula of the feeding and amount of the energy consumed with the time of the energy is equal to the power time of the time so the um, power is measured for the unit of watts for the time of the energy time of the measure for the unit of the watts over the energy that it will be watts hours how much energy does 60 watt load consume in the 10 hour time the formula would be given energy times power times watts 60 watts times 10 hours 600 watt hours um six tenths the kilowatt um Alternating current circuit of um, law for the same the resistance um um laws laws are the resistance circuit of the alternate voltage applied with the direct voltage so amps is equal to the volts over you know, over the ohms volts is equal to the ohms times the amps and volts is equal to the uh ohms is equal to the amp volt uh volts over the amps and proceed with the equation e the effective value with the alternating voltage with the amp the effective value with the alternating current direct current for example, um laws are other resistance circuit of the alternating currents flow in the circuit of the circuit that must be my um might exhibit the additional character of the of the resistance might exhibit the inductive reaction the capacity reactions are both the total opposition for the flow of current is called the impedance and is measured with the symbol of the the arm laws then become the voltage amp is equal to the amp volt over the um, impedance of the voltage is equal to the amps times the impedance of the volt impedance is equal to the volts over the amps so where current and amps equal the voltage um uh, I, I, I the current and amps of e is uh, e the voltage in volts and z is impedance and um, the finally impedance of the alternating current with the circuit of 120 alternating voltage source. Uh, so we're moving on to voltage uh, and um, the arms in a uh, AC circuit, which would give you if you had 120 volts alternating voltage source with 30 amps, you'd have 120 over 30 would give you four, four arms impedance. Impedance for the circuit circuit they given in by the expression impedance is equal to the square root of the resistance in arms plus the inductive reactions for the arms minus the capacitive reactions of the arms squared. If the AC circuit is with the resistance. 5 ohm with the inductive reaction for 10 ohm with the capacity of reaction for 6 ohms, what is the impedance over the ohm? The impedance is equal to the, re, um, the re, um, resistance in ohms, uh, the square root of the resistance squared, uh, the square root of the resistance ohms plus the inductive reaction times the minus the capacity of reaction squared, uh, or 5 times 5 with 10 plus 10 minus 6 squared it would give you uh, 6.4 ohms. And note the value of the inductive capacity of reaction for the circuit depends on the on the frequency current side of the spacing length of the conductor making over the circuit of the distribution circuit of the transmission line of the area was located with appropriate tables. All right, in the expression, um, in terms of whether no indu whether neither inductive reactions nor capacity reactions, the impedance is reduced to the value of the, of the arm. The impedance is equal to the square root of the arms of the minus plus um, zero minus zero, or impedance of the um, the uh, square root of the arms. Equals ohms. Likewise, only exists uh, only resistance inductive reactions are pressure um, present in circuit of the expression of the impedance of the impedance of the um, square root of the um, um, square and plus the inductive reactions minus um, zero is equal to the inductive um, equal to the um, um, the square root of the ohm um, squared minus plus the um, the inductive reaction squared. The the impedance of the AC circuit to the three ohm. The resistance. The four ohm inductive reactions continue in the series. The impedance is equal to the square root of the ohms um, plus the inductive Reaction squared would be equal to three times um, the square root of three times two. The three four would be uh, three squared plus four two um, four squared would give you nine ohms or um, twenty five. The square, the square root of twenty five or five ohms. Dependent line loss reactions for law. The formula of computing power level for the resistance of the line power is equal to amps times uh, squared times the ohms. Where the symbol of the same meaning as well, but the correct the Formula um, for the state of the power law of the resistance over the equal to the current of the amp squared multiplied by the resistance of ohms. Watts is equal to the amp squared times the ohms. The compute the power of the line having the resistance of 3 ohms and 20 amps. The following is the 20 squared uh, um, times 3 is 120 watt um, times the ohms would give you 1200 watt of the power formula. The single base of the AC circle of the power is equal to the volt times the amps times the power frequency, the power watts, voltage, um, a voltage, I count. And amps power PF power fa factor and circuit. Um, express the word of formula set of the power in watts for the drum of the single phase AC circuit equal to the draw product volts and amperes of the power factor of the power factor unity 
equality of one of the power equal to the power of the volts and amperes. So amps is equal to the power over the um, volts times the power of frequency. So you had 60 over 120 times 1 it gives you a half amp. Power of the power current with the drone of the 10 kilowatt load from the 220 volt AC circuit power factor is 80 of 8 tenths. So you'd have a um, 10,000 kilowatts over the 200 power volts over the 80 um, power factor gives you 66.8 amp as a power factor. In similar manner, the power voltage current also known with the power factor can be computed by the following term. Power factor is equal to the power over the volts minus times the amps. Um, so uh, when the power factor is the 4 kilo load um, operating at 230 volt with the current drawn at two, uh, um, 20 amps, you have the power frequency of the equal to 4,000 ohm time over 230 times 20. We give you the AC 10% power factor of the power form of the three phase AC circuit power factor. Equal is equal to the uh, square root of three times the volts times the amps times the power frequency of the wave of the voltage wave of the wave of the other sample they have the same thing the single wave of the additional quantity in the three phase form of the factor with the square root of three the square and square root of the three value of the, the square root three is one point seven three voltage between the phase of the wire is equal to the square root of three or one point seven three multiplied by the phase of the neutral voltage of the three phase of the four wire system how much power the water on um, watts drawn from three phase is loaded at 230 volts. Um, the current is at 10 amp. The power factor is at 80 percent. You have three times 230 volts. Um, the power factor, the uh, the voltage in three phase times the 200, which is square root of three, 1.73 times 230, 230 volts. Um, times the amps times the 0.8 power for, um, factor would be 3,183 volts. The free phase, the free phase power formula the table of four quantity for the single phase form. Therefore, they are known with the fourth of the one computer. Remember that they can call the voltage current of the power factor known by the illustrated previously. The power voltage of the power factor known by the current of the three phase lamp is from the formula. Amp is equal to the power over the um, the three phase um, square root would give you the volt times the power frequency. If the 15 kilowatt three phase of the load operated at 2300 volts, they have the power factor of one. How much fa current flow for each of the thing, um, three, three phase? The 15,000 of the um, three phase. Uh, um, square rooted with the 2300 volts um, times the 1.05 factor give you the 13.7 the, the amps. The only quantity known for the power factor that could be um, if if the one quantity is um, only one if the only quantity known for the power factor that can be found by even the following the power factor is equal to the power over the um, three phase square root times the volt times the amp of the of the power factor 100 kilowatt three phase load operating in the 2300 volt line current with 400 amps you'd have uh 100 100,000 amps over the three times uh, divided by three fifty times the 2300 volts times the 40 and power for um amps would give you the 62.8 power factor all right volt amperes often loaded with a given the volt amperes instead of the watt with the kilovolt amperes instead of the kilowatt relationship but then become of the volt amperes equal to the volts times the amps in single phase volt amperes equal to the square root of volt times um, Square root of three times the volt times one is the three phase. The use of these quantities not necessarily the, is not necessary to uh, know the power factor of the load. Power factor correction. The determine the kilovolt and power factor. Um, 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 kilovolt volt ohms. Um, um, required to improve the power factor for the known load following step. Determine the existing kilovolt amperes load with the kilo, um, kilovolt amperes existing. Times uh, equal the kilovolt. Oh, um, the oh, kilovolt amperes equal the kilowatts over the power. Factor. Power factor existing, determine the existing reactive power load existing in the compactor voltage armors um, existing over the equals the square root of kilo, um, kilowatt voltage amper squared existing minus the kilowatt um, uh, squared. Determine the corrected kilovolt amp, um, load kilo amper corrected equal to kilowatts over the power for frequency corrected. Step four, determine the corrected reflected reactive power load expressed in the kilovolt amper arms corrected equals kilo, uh, the square root of kilovolt amper squared minus the kilowatt um, squared. Squared. All right, step five. Required to correct the reactive power is equal to the existing reactive power load minus the corrective reactive power load. The example of the kilovolt amperes um, arms required and the equal to the kilovolt amperes arms um, existing minus the kilovolt amperes corrective. The, for example, the 40 kilowatts load of the 80 percent power factor the equal to the kilovolt arm is needed to correct the power factor of 90 percent. The first step of the term of the Kilovolt load with the existing load. The kilovolt uh, amperes with the existing over the kilowatt over the power frequency existing is equal to 40. Um, in this example, it's 40 over um, 8 tenths that would give you 50 kilovolt amperes. Step to determine the reactive power load with the existing condition. Kilovolt amperes is equal to the kilovolt amperes squared times the kilovolt um, kilowatt squared equal to the 
of the oh, underneath the square root. The square root of 50 times um, squared minus 40 squared equals 10, um, 30 um, kilovolt amp ammers. Having found existing um, condition with the reactive power low, determine what the corrective final value of the total reactive power will be. The kilovolt amperes corrected with the equal to kilowatts over the power frequency 40 to minus uh, 10 tens 41.4 kilovolt amperes set for kilovolt um, uh, amperes on the um, corrected and kilo is the square root of kilovolt amperes squared minus the kilowatt uh, squared we give you 19 of the 19.37 uh, the kilovolt uh, um, uh, um, um, or reactive to determine the amount of reactive power needed for the system correct the power factor the 80 to 90 percent final step over the problem is subtract the corrective reactive Reactive power desired with the existing rea value of the re um, reactive power. Kilovolt amp to reactive power required is equal to the kilovolt amp to re re am um, reactive existing minus kilovolt amp to reactive corrected 30 minus 1937. They give you 10 points so we can kill that amp or react reactive. The line loss resistance in the three phase, the power loss in three phase line given the expression is power is equal to 3 minus to, um, times 2 amp squared times um. When the current is in each line with the resistance, or is the resistance in each line. The factor three um, presents the loss in line while it's taken from the three times um, the account of the lines of the uh, loss in all three wires. All right, examples of the three phase line with the carrier of the current of the 12 amps in each line with the head of the resistance of the three amps. How much power loss of the resistance would you have? You have the power of the time three times the amp um, squared would give you 100 um, times three would give you 1,296 um, or 1.296 kilowatts. Electrical apparatuses. All right. Motor, direct current mo motor, the two, the two quantity for the usually desired with the electrical motor, the output with the horsepower, with the impact rating, and full flow with the full expression of the current used with the motor, direct current, the amperage of the equal to the horsepower times 746 of the time of the volt, oh, over the volts, uh, uh, time of the efficiency formula, shift of the full over the current obtained with multiplying horsepower by 746 of the result provided under the article of the voltage power efficiency, the number of the watts of the one horsepower is 746. In kilowatt example, the one point the one and one third uh, 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 one and one third uh, horsepower. How much current with a five horsepower, two hundred thirty volt DC draw with the full load and efficiency below the ninety percent? You'd have the amperes over the five times the seven hundred forty six horsepower volt times two hundred thirty times the efficiency of the ninety percent. But they'd give you eighteen amps. Alternating current motor, single phase of the motor, single phase of the AC with the expression current with the almost example. Same except for the most of the all the power factor for the form of the full. Load. Load current the amperage of the equal to the horsepower times 746 watts. The voltage over the efficiency times the power factor. The example of how many amperes of one quarter of the um, horsepower um, take of the full load of the motor rated at 110 volts of the full load efficiency 85%. Full load power factor at 80%. The amperage equal to the horsepower times 746 quarter of the 746 times the voltage times the efficiency of the 85% times the power factor of 80 at 2.5 amps. All right. Um, the main current motor three phase the formula for load full load current of the three phase motor of the chain of the single phase motor except that the factor is the square root of three and this the um the amplitude of the horsepower times seven hundred and forty six watts time of the um the the uh the factor of the um the, the square root of three times the whole time the efficient power factor and then you come up with the same solution except but the um uh divided by the square root of the uh, Except the uh, square root through is stuck in into it. Direct current define the horsepower rating of the DC motor with the voltage of the current rating known by the sum of the quantity of the current expected the whole formula is thus the horsepower is equal to the voltage time and the amp time with efficiency over the seven hundred four six. How many um can the can a volt two hundred twenty volt DC motor deliver with the draw with the fifty amp with efficiency of ninety percent? You'd have two hundred twenty uh, times fifteen times over the zero point nine times over seven hundred four six four horsepower. Alternating current single phase of the horsepower formula you the single phase AC motor. Horsepower is equal to the volts time of the amp time of the power efficiency time of the eff efficiency times seven hundred power factor time of the efficiency seven hundred forty six. An example of that would be uh, with the horsepower rating with the single day for the motor optic with the four hundred eighty volt for the drawing twenty five um, amp, amp the power factor eighty eight percent of the full load with the efficiency ninety eight percent with the four hundred eighty times twenty five times eighty eight percent power factor times ninety percent power efficiency um, gives you twelve point seven four horsepower. Alternating current motor three phase the horsepower formula three phase a. The motor, uh, the horsepower is equal to the, um, the square root of three times the volt time of the amp is the power efficiency uh, factor times the efficiency over 746 watts. Um, example: What the horse, um, what the, what the power is delivered to the three phase 240 volt motor delivered the draw with the 10 amp the power factor 80 percent of the head efficiency 85 percent of the horsepower with the equal to the square root of three times the three times the volt times the power efficiency times the efficiency. Um, power factor per time of the efficiency over 3, 746 to get 3.80 horsepower in that 
Example, alternating current generator frequency with the voltage generator with the AC ge um, generator that depends on the number of the poles of the field, the speed at which with the rotate the frequency of the um, the frequency of the is equal to the power time of the um, the number of poles time of the re uh, revolutions per minute over the 120 with um, which give the uh, um, with revolutions per minute compute the frequency of the voltage of the generator with the alternating the two pole of the rotating at 360 rpms. You have the frequency in hertz is equal to the um, number of poles time of the Revolutions per minute over 120 um, with revolutions per minute. We give the 60 hertz. Determine the speed at which the alternator should be driven. The generator that uh, gives the frequency of the following expression would be the revolutions per minute times the frequency in hertz times the 120 over the uh, over the um, number of poles on the field at which the speed of the four pole alternator of the generator is 60 hertz. The revolutions per minute times the frequency in hertz times the 120 with the um, would be the revolutions per minute over the over the Poles in the number of the field that gives you 60 times 120 over the times 4 divided by 4 or 1800 RPM. Um, RPM. The number of the pole frequency of the alternator over the number of the pole of the field can be calculated. Calculate you the following number of the power. Number of poles is equal to due to the, the, um, the frequency in hertz time of the 120 um, revol um, freq 120 revolutions per minute over the. Uh, or, sorry, 120 um, times over the revolutions per minute. All right, how many pills does an alternator if the generator is 60 hertz at 1200 RPMs? You'd have um, the uh, 60 hertz um, times the 120 over 120 gives you six poles. The transformer single phase um, primary current with a full load. Primary current can be readily calculated with the kilovolt amper rating with the transformer. The primary voltage known. The um, the uh, primary current is equal to the kilovolt amper the time with 1000 over the voltage primary uh, primary voltage. Primary vo voltage rated primary voltage and IP is rated the um, primary current. For example, the rated full primary current with the 10 kilovolts at 2300 volts distribution transformer. The amp power, um, the primary uh, amp is equal to kilovolts times 1000 e over the voltage primary, would give you 10 times 1000 um, um, equal to over 2300, would give you 4.3 amps. Secondary current with expression and secondary current is similar to the four with the primary current. The um, um, amp secondary is equal to the kilovolt amps over the times 1000 over the volt secondary with a uh, Y is. I S for the I with the base of S, S for the rate of the secondary current voltage of the volt base of S rated the secondary voltage through the kilovolt um amp distribution transformer is rated at two hundred three hundred volts primary and one hundred ten volts secondary the full load secondary uh, the full load of the secondary voltage of the volts the secondary amp or sorry the amp voltage amp secondary is equal to the kilovolt and amp times one thousand over the volts the secondary would give you three times one hundred over the one hundred ten with twenty seven amp secondary. Summary. Electrical formulas for summary of the circuit calculation table one one and then uh, well you get your direct current single phase and three phase alternate currents for the amperage to kill the volts and the voltage known the kill the amplitude no voltage known the amper to kill the volt voltage power factors known the kill the volt amp the voltage power factors known. Note that the kilowatts are one hundred amperes are a uh, I V E is volts and kilowatts and kilovolt amperes is KVA. Um, one point seven three was your uh, square root, and your three phases the square root of three. All right, current direct current defined with the current, uh, current voltage of the resistance given the amp the time of the amps over the voltage of the um over the over the amps alternating current over the voltage of the resistance given the amp the equal the voltage over the amp the alternating current defined with the current. Of the voltage impedance is equal to the amps over the voltage over the, over the impedance of the direct current of the, the voltage with the power of the given is amps over the equal to the power over the volt for the alternating current signal phase defined with the current of the voltage for the power and power factor of the amp um, is equal to the power over the volts over the power factor of the alternating current three phase the final of the current of the voltage of the power and power factor amps equal to the power over the square root of three times the power factor alternating current signal phase the final of the current with the voltage amp the voltages are given the amps equal to the voltage amp over the volt uh, over the volts, or one kilovolt and one kilovolt amp is equal to one thousand over the volts. Alternating current three phase the time of the current of the voltage amp of the volts. Given then um amp the equal to the volt amp is over the square root of three times the volts. Amp equal to one equal to the kilovolt amp the time of the one hundred one thousand equal to the square root of three times the volts. Uh, Instead of three alternating three phase. All right, voltage direct current the time of the voltage over the current the, over the resistance of the given the voltage is equal to the amp the time of the amp. So the um alternating current defined by the current of the resistance the given the voltage of the equal to the um the uh amps time of the amps alternating current defined by the voltage of the current and of the equal to the volts time of the amps time of the amps and of the direct current defined by the resistance of the voltage current given the amps time of the equal to the voltage over the amps alternating current defined by the resistance of the voltage current as is in the amps equals equal to the 
volts for the amps of the direct um the power law for the direct current with the final power law for the current reactance of the given the power is equal to the amps squared times the amps the L's and current signal phase of the final power law for the current resistance power is equal to the amps squared times the amps the L's and current three phase of the final the power law of the current resistance of the power is equal to three times the amps times squared times the amps dependence all the current signal phase of the final dependence of the current of the voltage the voltage dependence is equal to the voltage over the amps all the current signal phase to find the impedance of the resistance the inductive reactance with the impedance is equal to equal the square root of the amp squared times the inductive reactance um squared um all the current signal phase to find the given the impedance of the resistance with the inductive reactance commands is reacting to give it the impedance is equal to the square root of the amp squared times and plus the um, inductive reactance minus the inductive capacity squared the right current to find the power of the voltage current with the given the power is equal to the voltage times the amp alternating Signal phase of the final of the power of the voltage current and the power give actor given the power is equal to the voltage time of the amp time of the power factor of the power um all the current three phase of the final of the power of the voltage current for the power of the given the, the, the power is equal to the square root of three times of the volt time of the amp time of the power factor of the voltage amp the amp volt amperes alternating current single phase of the final of the volt amperes with the volts and current with the given the volt amps equal to the voltage time of the amps and the kilovolt amperes is equal to the voltage time of the amps over one thousand alternating current three phase of the final of the volt amps with the volt of the currents given with the volt amp is equal to the square root of three times the volt on the time the amps or the kilovolt is the square root of three times the volt time of the amps or the one thousand the power factor alternating current equal phase with the time of the power factor for the um, power volts for the amps are given the power factor is equal to the power over the um amps uh, oh sorry over the volt, volt time of the amps alternating current three phase with the time of the power factor for the power volt amp is given the power factor is equal to the power over the square root of three times the amps um time of the volts for the direct current motor to find the Current of the horsepower of the motor of the volts of the efficiency are given the amp time of the horsepower times 746 watts. Time of the volts to over the, uh, sorry, um, amps equal the ho horsepower times 746 over the, um, square root, uh, sorry, uh, amps is equal the horsepower times 746 watts over the volts of, uh, and the efficiency of the alternating current signal phase of the time of the current for the horsepower of the motor of the volts of the efficiency of the power factor of the given. Amps equal the horsepower times 746 volts for the uh, time of the, over the volts and time of the power factor time of the efficiency. Notes, and I believe we'll move on to chapter two after this. So, chapter two line conductors.